welcome back to the channel today. Well, I've treated myself um, to the Drift Ghost XL as my old camera gave up. So yeah, so I've got one of the one of these bad boys. Got it on a good deal on eBay and with uh, thirty percent off code. We'll see, this looks like a it was one of the, one of the new ones done in twenty twenty one. So hopefully the firmware will be up to date. But yeah, there we go. So I will unbox this and. Uh, Give it a go, and we'll, uh, I'll try and do a video on uh, what I think of it. So here we go, obviously I've taken the outer layer off. Obviously I haven't opened it up yet. Oh, there we go, there it is. Quite nice and small. Give it a wiggle, but yeah, there we go. That's the camera itself. It focuses my phone. What else are you get in there then? So it looks like you get a, the quick guide. Oh, some bedtime reading, I'll look for that. And in here, assuming it'll be just the usual. Yep, yeah, looks like the two mounts, one's curved and one's flat for your helmet. You've got the charging lead, the mic lead. USB things in there, so cool. Well, there you go, that's the uh, unboxing of the uh, first of the XL. I will do a follow up video of the first of the XL. Right, I've had it set up onto my uh, helmet as you can see. I've even got the mic, I actually went for the drift mic, microphone, uh, to get it all set up. And yeah, I've got it working nicely now. I thought I'd just quickly show you how I've, I've routed all the wires. Um, as you can see in there, that is where the mic cable has just slotted into it nicely. And um, this cable here is for my uh, intercom, which is in there. But yeah, I've just tucked all the wires neatly in under the uh, under the cheek padding. Um, so there's obviously my intercom uh, speaker. But yeah, as you can see, I've run it all the way through. Let's put the helmet down. Through the cheek padding, and I've just attached it onto my uh, intercom mic. And so, yeah, all in all... I've only tested it in the house. I'm going to go out tomorrow and uh, and give it a session. So uh, I'll see uh, see you in a minute on YouTube when I uh, ride the bike. Cheers. Right here we go. Let's uh, see how well this camera goes, shall we? Right, well this is the first ride, I think it's recording, looks like it, so right, I'm out for the day, I'm not going to film all day, well I probably will film all day, but I'm not going to be talking to you all day, this is just uh, showing you what it's like out in the real world with the mic, I tested it before I left the house um, to make sure it was all working and it seems to be using the uh, drift app uh, which you're seeking download um, I turned the Wi-Fi off as you know for when I'm out on the bike purely because of what I read in comments and other YouTube videos before I bought this uh, so yeah let's see how this records if you're seeing it you you know it's working <laughs> and unfortunately it's a uh, as well as that. Now it's uh, 10 to 8 in the morning. It's quite cold. It's fairly breezy on this bank holiday Friday. I've got my heated grips on. Must have, haven't they? Must have. It's about 3 degrees. Obviously, it's meant to be warming up and getting a bit more sunny. Ooh, a bit bumpy around here. And uh, yeah, I'm going to meet my, my mate with his uh, Triumph Speed Triple. 
the 1050, not the new RS obviously, but um, yeah, it's an absolute weapon. So uh, yeah, we're going to go meet with him. We're going to have a nice road trip up the Shropshire Hills. And uh, yeah, that's basically what we're doing this Bank Holiday Friday. So hopefully, all in all, um, I'll do a follow-up video clip on uh, my thoughts and reactions to whatever I see from this film. Uh, with, uh, regarding sound quality with this mic, if it's working, obviously, um, and the general picture quality. Uh, but yeah, there we go. I'll leave it to you, and I'll speak to you in a minute on YouTube. Ta! Cool. Now, I've just got back from my uh, six-hour road trip around the Shropshire Hills. Uh, which has been absolutely brilliant. The uh, Drift XL Ghost, as you probably just seen a clip, has worked superbly well. It's still running now. Um, battery life, absolutely amazing. I don't think I had the mic in the right place, but, you know, TV problems on the first ride out. But overall, I'm really, really happy. Um, so I hope this review's been good. Um, longevity, obviously I'll let you know if I have any issues. But, thumbs up at the moment. Um, if you'd like to like and subscribe, and I will catch you on the next one. Cheers.